Hey everybody, uh, TV Chips, uh, and I have a brand, ooh, I got real close with the, get real close, okay, uh, I won't do that again. Uh, I have a new subscription box, uh, as I was saying uh, a couple of videos ago, uh, in my hobby box, new hobby box, I went on uh, Crate Joy and I was looking at some different um, subscription boxes and I came across three new subscription boxes that I wanted to give a try. The first was obviously the new hobby box. Uh, I will be doing an update on that soon. But this next one I got today is one I'm probably looking the most forward to. Um, if you've been following any of my vlogs, you know that I recently had a little, little surgical thing done. Um, and uh, I found this. My bariatric box. Uh, very cool, very exciting. I keep going. It's a cool, I love it. Um, a, a great message and everything like that. So this is a subscription box. Uh, I think it's $29.99, I want to say. It is a monthly box. Um, and it's full of like, uh, you know, protein bars and some shake mixes and things like that. It's, it's just a lot of stuff that, uh, you know, people who have had bariatric surgery are kind of limited in what they can eat and drink and all that kind of stuff. And so this box kind of aims to help uh, expose us to some other stuff. So some protein bars you can't buy individually. You have to buy them in a box with other protein bars. And, you know, I don't know about you, but I don't really want to take a chance on something that I'm maybe not going to like. Uh, so this is really great because it allows you to um, be able to try... Um, some things that you may not have ever tried because maybe you don't see them uh, in your stores or they can only be bought online, things like that. So, very cool. Uh, I keep going. Very cool hashtag. So, let's take a look. Um, yeah, I want to say it's like $29.99 or something like that, somewhere along those lines. Um, but I'll put the link to them in, in, the, in the description below. So, we shall see what they have. So, let's see what they got so looks like this is maybe like a card like a spoiler card so I'm gonna put that to the side and this is what's in the box that's what's in the box okay let's check it out all right first things first I'm seeing something I'm not really excited about this is protein water um, I've not had by pro um, more, I've not had the Bipro water, but I'm not a big fan of protein water. It usually tastes very milky. Not, I don't enjoy it. Um, it does have 20 grams of protein um, per this like 17 ounce container. So <sighs> we'll try it. We'll try it. Um, but I'm not going to like it. it smells. Oh God, it smells awful. The taste is not that bad. It tastes like crunch berries. Tastes like generic crunch berries. Um, it, not awful. It's better than the Protein 2O, which is not... I, I did not like that. Um, I'm going to put this in the fridge, and maybe I will drink it. Probably won't. All right, next up we have... Oh, I have seen these in stores before, but I have never purchase them because like I said sometimes you're just like I don't want to spend three dollars on a protein bar that I'm gonna hate um, even though I did want to try it so this is a um, beyond cereal protein bar and this is a waffle flavored oh, uh, bar it's got 12 grams of protein and 110 calories um, it's gluten free so let's take a little bitey bite and see what it tastes like. Maybe it's good. I probably not won't be. Probably gonna be awful. Um, so that's what it looks like. Look at that. That's what it looks like. I know you can't really. Um, smells very cereally. Smells like waffles and syrup. Take a bite. Um, that's not bad. 
Um, that's not bad at all. It's got a um, it's got a very syrupy flavor. Um, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. I can get down with that. It's a little more syrupy than waffly, but whatever. I'll take it. Next is another protein bar. This is from Oh Yeah. This is the One Bar. One. Um, this has two gram, uh, one gram of sugar and 20 grams of protein. Uh, and it's 230 calories. I'm technically supposed to say under 200 calories if I'm doing a protein bar. This one is 110. Um, so, but I'm not usually finishing my protein bars in one sitting. So this would be 10 grams of protein and 115 calories if I split it in half. That's not bad. Um, yeah, I would, I would probably split this in half. I probably wouldn't eat the whole thing. This also feels like it's a very dense bar. Some protein bars feel a little light. This feels light. This cereal bar feels light. This thing feels heavy. It feels very heavy. And it's um, cinnamon roll flavored. All right. I've not tried Oh Yeah yet. Uh, I see them quite often in the grocery stores and uh, where I get, the, you know, all the different stuff. But um, I have not tried it yet. Uh, I'm also not a fan of coated protein bars. Ah, oh, boy. All right. Let's take a bite. Oh, okay. It's very soft. Very soft. Um... Hmm. That's actually not bad. That's not bad. It does taste like a cinnamon roll. Uh, two for two. Two for two on tasting what they're supposed to be. Um... Does have a little bit of a weird aftertaste. Um... Those both taste a little sweet. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing. But they taste a little... Because this one's got kind of the... This one you're getting more of the, the syrup flavor. So it's got that sweetness from syrup. The syrup, syrup flavor. And then this one you're getting a lot more of the, the icing. From the cinnamon roll flavor. Again, not, that's a bad thing. Alright, next up. I'm not sure about this. There's two of them in here. Uh, they appear to be the same thing. It's just two of them. Uh, original grass-fed smoked beef stick. Uh, this is 8 grams of protein. It's 90 calories. Um, made with 100% grass-fed beef. Never given antibiotics or hormones. Gluten and soy-free. No nitrates. No MSG. No sugar added. Product of the USA. Alright, well... Let's take a bite. Oh boy. So, <laughs> I don't know what I expected, but usually all this stuff just sounds awful and you just gotta like fight through it and taste it and be like, all right, that wasn't that bad. So, this is what it looks like. It's a beef stick. It's a beef stick. It's like a, like a big old, big old beef stick. It smells all right. got the texture of a excuse me mm, no nope 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 sorry no Nope, did not enjoy that. Um, like, I, no, I don't know. Yeah, did not enjoy that. Now, I may go back and try it again later or tomorrow um, just to see for sure. But, yeah, I did not enjoy that. I definitely had to spit that out. Okay, um, next up we have, ooh. These are from On, it looks like. On Protein. Uh, this is manufactured in the USA. Um, 
Optimum Nutrition, it looks like the same. These are protein cake bites. Deliciously whipped protein snack. Huh. It appears as there are three of these little bad boys in here. And it's a red velvet flavor. There's three cake bites. Each one... Oh, it's one serving, so 230. Again, uh, they're all kind of a little bit over 200, so I just kind of don't mind it. Uh, it does have 20 grams of protein, uh, 230 calories. All right, I'm game. Let's try it. Let's see what we got here. Uh, it, ooh. They always, all the coating on all of these protein bar things, Always feels so chalky. Um, let's bust this open since it's already kind of cracked. It is, oh my god, it is. Uh, yeah, that's not great right there. Let's see, can I get focus? I don't know if it's going to focus on that. Um, it's definitely got kind of a protein bar texture. Um, let's give it a taste. Oh, okay. Haha. <laughs> I like this. I like this a lot. Yes. Yes. I believe this is a winner. Yes, yes. I promised I wouldn't get that close to the camera. And I've done it many, many times. Yeah, this is a winner. I don't have another bite. I don't have any more protein bars in there. So I'm going to finish this little piece. Not right now. I can't fit something that big. All right. Next up. So we've got already had um, one, two, three, four. We've already had five items. Six if you count that there were two of these beef sticks. Um, and there's three other items it looks like in the box, as far as I can see, green items. So that's a good. That's that's a good amount of stuff for one. This is a packet of Bipro. Um, whey protein isolate supplement. Um, doesn't look like it's got a flavor. So this looks maybe like it's flavorless. Um, yeah, this appears to be flavorless protein, I guess. I don't know. It doesn't say. The only ingredients are whey protein isolate and sunflower lechen. 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 Uh, it suggests that we mix this with eight ounces of cold water, skim milked, or add to my favorite recipe. Consume one or more servings daily. Protein requirements may vary per person based on body weight. So this is 80 calories, and it is 20 grams of protein. That's not bad. Um, so if you mix this with your water, um, or if you mix it with milk, you can get more protein and more calories. Um, there's a lot of the stuff you could do with a flavorless protein. If this is flavorless, another one thing you could do is you could mix this with some sugar-free jello and make some gummy bears. What? Um, next up we have another packet. This is from Click Active. This is all-in-one coffee and protein drink mix. This is a double shot of espresso coffee. Uh, that's exciting. This has 25 grams of protein and 130 calories. That's not bad. Uh, 10 ounces of your favorite beverage into a shaker cup. This would probably be really good with milk. I'm going to go on a limb. Probably very good with milk. So there you go. And then, yep, it looks like there is only one item in the box. So uh, the bariatric box, from what I understand, always comes with like seven or eight or so products to test and then a six or seven products to test and then um, it also comes with something like else like a little you know uh, you know a useful tool for you in your in your bariatric journey and this is very cool this is very exciting this is a stainless steel peeler uh, so that you can make um, veggie noodles and whatnots with it um, very, very cool. The box is a little beat up, but that's, that's not, that's no big deal. This is nice. Ooh, this is nice. Ooh, look at this. 
That's nice. This is really cool. I mean, you could pay, you know, $20, $30 for something like this. So this is a vegetable peeler. Um, so you can, if you see that, it's it's got a lot of tiny little tines. And you can make, like, zucchini, zucchini noodles or carrot noodles or squash noodles or uh, asparagus noodles or uh, perturnip noodles or uh, uh, broccoli noodles or potato noodles. Ooh, sweet potato. Sweet potato noodles. Those might fall apart. And yeah, maybe don't make sweet potato noodles. That might be a bad idea. Uh, that might have been a bad idea. Um, that's cool. So yeah, so that, um, this, you know, having like something to help out with the journey and, you know, uh, obviously being limited in what I can eat and not being able to eat noodles, but you know, some people still want that pasta stuff in their life. That's a great, that's really cool. And like I said, for the price, you can't really beat it. There's a couple things in here. Um, there's the bariatric box referral program. Um, which I didn't sign up for yet, so it doesn't really matter. Um, and then uh, an advertisement for the Bipro uh, protein supplements. And there's even a coupon in here for Bipro. So um, very, very cool. Very, very cool. Let's take a look. There was a, that spoiler card thing on the box. Um, so uh, it's just a note from the person who puts the box together. Her name is Nikki. It's also very, um, very responsive. I emailed her a question when I signed up. I was like, hey, when, when does this ship? When will I expect it? And she was like, oh, it's going next week. So, and then I got it like a week and a half later. Um, in April, it looks like they're going to have pork clouds. And so you can currently on Facebook and Instagram at my bariatric box, you can vote on the items for next month's box. And they want to know which flavor of pork cloud pork clouds, fried pork rinds you would like to try. It looks like there's rosemary and sea salt, habanero pepper, and malwa. I don't know what that says. I don't know what that says. So there's, you know, options. Um, you got the, the protein shake. Um, it gives you a little bit of behind it. These are like $4 a packet. Uh, let's see. The, un yes, yeah, so this is unflavored whey protein, um, and this is, uh, like a box of these, a box of 14 of these is 23 bucks. So, that's cool. I can try this, and if I like it, I can invest. Um, the Biopro water is $5 a bottle. Protein water is not cheap, but that's, that seems like a lot. Uh, um, there is a code BB17 if you want to order Biopro. BB17 if you want to order anything from Bipro. It's 20% off. Um, the Sogo Snacks. Yuck. Um, $25 for 12 sticks. You know how teed off I would be if I paid $25 for 12 sticks of that thing that I did not like? Uh, yeah, not, not enjoyable. Um... Let's see, the Oh Yeah Cinnamon Roll Protein Bar, a box of 20, 12 of these is $28. Worth it if you like the taste, but how are you going to know? If you don't like the taste, you're never going to know. Um, and then the Quest Beyond Cereal Waffle Protein Bar, again, $15 for $25.99. And then these amazing, oh, these beautiful Optimum Nutrition Red Velvet Protein Cake Bites. Um, you can get these on Amazon. Another thing here is it tells you where you can get all of this stuff. So not only does it list how much it is, how much you'll get in like a box, it lists where you can go. So GNC, SoGo Snacks, Oh Yeah Nutrition, Amazon.com, Bipro USA, DrinkClick.com. That's great. Um, these are 12 bars at $25. Again. I would invest in these. These aren't bad. I'd like to see what other flavors I've got. So it just fully dawned on me that there may be other flavors of this out there. Guess what I'm doing after this video? 
Yep. Yep. Okay. So we got. Let's see. We got the veggie straw thingy. We got the protein water. Meh. Not bad. It was better than the protein 2 well. Cereal protein bar. Very good. Very good. A little sweet, but very good. Cinnamon roll. Pretty good. I'm gonna eat. So good. Exciting. New. Interesting. And hello. Coffee and protein. And then, um, these sticks. I did not enjoy them. Um, I don't necessarily care for, uh, meat sticks, if you will. Meat sticks. Uh, I'm not a big fan of meat sticks, so this wasn't probably going to be in my wheelhouse anyways. Um, I like a regular jerky over a beef stick any day. But, well worth the value. Awesome. Already looking forward to next month. So that is um, MyBariatricBox.com. If you would like to sign up, you can go there and sign up. Even if you're not a bariatric person, if you, are not, if you haven't had the surgery or you're not considering it or whatever, you know, if you're just looking to eat healthier, this is a great al alternative. It, you know, um, the things that we're focusing on as bariatric patients is high protein and low calorie. And that's something that even before I had the surgery, that was something I was trying to focus on. So it's great to be able to try these things and then see see if, if I like them or not. And this is cool. This is, you could probably pay about what you paid for the box for something like this. So it's all worth it. It's definitely all worth it. This stuff is expensive. And um, so it's great that we have this option. So thank you for watching. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and you can subscribe to my channel. And um, we'll see my bariatric box next month because... This was awesome. All right, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna take another bite of these, and then that's it. I'm tapped out. I'm gonna vomit if I eat any more than that. And I'm gonna go look up and see what other flavors there are. So, yeah, it's all. All right, everybody, have a good one. I'll see you later. Bye.